Hello everyone! Today we will be looking at Windows ME data. This is a recently leaked build which comes with some interesting features. Anyway, let's get on with it. So let's get on with it. One of the more complicated tasks Windows ME is capable of doing is playing Solitaire. This couldn't be done on most machines of the time because of how resource taking this was. Jokes aside, this is the help center. It resembles the Windows XP version a lot. Although it feels empty, it does work and has some topics on it. There's a few online links as well, but those are long gone. Next we have a system restore program. Oh god damn it. Next we have a system restore program. This was a feature that got into the final version of Windows ME. However, in this build it seems to be in a very early state. I can't show this off because I don't have any saved states at the moment, but you probably get how this works anyway. This next thing I want to sh- Um? That wasn't supposed to happen. I guess I'll just restart. So it turns out the crash made Windows uninstall all my drivers, which is very useful. So this next feature wouldn't work on my VM, so I have used screenshots uploaded by the F10 on VidaWiki. Anyway, this is the Activity Center. It has a few differences to the version in codename Neptune. One of the main differences is that the Game Center is completely absent from this build. And as opposed to the jump scene in Neptune, this has a theme called Circus. Unfortunately, the Circus theme doesn't work. Anyway, the last thing I want to show you is this early version of the Oob. This kind of reminds me of early builds of Whistler. This page didn't make it into the final version of ME. Things are going well, all I need to do is enter my product key. Um? I'm pretty sure my product key is correct, so I guess I can only do one thing at this point. Before I end the video, I would just like to ask you guys something. Considering that I have just passed 1,000 subscribers, what would you like to see for a 1,000 subscriber special? Anyway, thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next video.